Hello and a very warm welcome to the Stade de Coubertin here in Paris for finals day at the Yonex French Open. Event number 10 on the 12 tournament MetLife BWF World Super Series. 12 tournaments throughout the year, the elite tier of tournaments in World Badminton. Plus, of course, we have the end of season championships, the Super Series finals to be staged this year in Dubai, this year and the next three years. And it's only the top eight players or pairs in each of those disciplines who will qualify for those finals. Well, here's the lineup for finals day. We're starting with an all Chinese women's doubles, Margin and Tang Kuan Ting up against the former world champions and former winners here, oh, Wang Xiaoli and Yu Yang. Then men's singles and Wang Xiaoming looking for his second Super Series title, appearing in his fifth Super Series tournament final. He's up against a man making history today, Chao Tian Chen, the first player from Chinese Taipei to contest a men's singles final at Super Series level. After that, we'll have a women's singles in the number one and two seeds, the Olympic champion against the defending champion. I'll tell you more about the order of play in a minute as we're looking at the women's doubles destination Dubai uh, rankings. This, the ranking for the qualification for those Super Series finals to be staged in Dubai. Well, as you saw, top two were Japanese pairs. And the top five remained unchanged, I can tell you, after Denmark. There will be changes after this tournament. Uh, back to what we can look forward to later on today, after the women's singles final, which should be a cracker with the Olympic champion against the defending champion. We'll then have mixed doubles and it will be Mr. and Mrs. Adcock, the Commonwealth Games gold medalists, in their second Super Series tournament final up against Tontoi, Ahmad and Liliana Nasir, the former world champions. The last of our finals this afternoon will see the 2010 winners, the number one seeds, Matthias Bow and Carsten Morgensen, up against Endo and Hawakawa, the number two seeds, in their sixth Super Series tournament final today. But they're still looking for their first ever Super Series title. Well, that's what we've got to look forward to later on today. Let's get on with all the action. It is the women's doubles final to start us off. An all Chinese affair in the red shirts. There are the former winners of this event and former world champions, two-time former world champions, Wang Xiaoli and Yu Young. They're the number seven seeds here in Paris. Their opponents, Ma Jin and Tang Kuan Ting, the number five seeds. Well, for Ma Jin, she is trying to win her third women's doubles title here with a third different partner. What an extraordinary achievement that would be. Champions here in 2011, two-time world champions in 2011 and 2013. Silver medalists, of course, earlier this year in the World Championships. Lynn Munn from the United States of America is our umpire for this one. And Michaela Benkova of the Czech Republic will be the service judge. Well, since the French Open became a Super Series event, which was at the inception of the Super Series, which started uh, back in 2007, the French Open has always been part of the Super Series, so that uh, makes this the eighth staging of the French Open as a Super Series. And I can tell you that only once in eight times have China failed to win the women's doubles. Because, of course, they're going to win the title here on the eighth staging. The only time they didn't win was back in 2010 when Duang Anong Arunkanson and Ujela Borovici Jaikal of Thailand took the title. So for Margin, 
Well, she was a busy lady yesterday. Two semi-finals to contest. She lost her mixed doubles with her Olympic silver medal partner. As we look at the draw, and you can see from quarter-final stage, only four different nations involved. Three Chinese pairs, three Japanese pairs, one Indonesian and one Danish pair. By semi-finals, it was overwhelmingly Chinese, and as you can see, an all-Chinese final. Number two seeds, Christina Pires and Camilla Ruta, you're losing in the quarter-final stage. But I have to say, the defending champions have lost at the last 16, Bao Yixin and Tang Jinhua. So to this relatively new pairing, number five seed, 16 in the world ranking, up eight places this week to a career high. The number six, as we saw on the Super Series standings, and as you can see, both their quarter-final and semi-final, as indeed had their opening match, are going the full distance against Matsuo and Nato uh, yesterday. Coming back from a game down, had to achieve the same thing at the quarter-final stage against number three seeds, Matsutomo and Takahashi. Well, very different paths for their opponents. The number seven seeds, Wang Xiao Li, 25 years of age on the right as we look at them. Yu Yang is 28. Number five in the world ranking up two places and it's because they were world ranked at number seven when the seeding was done as to why they are the number seven seeds. Winners, as I say, back in 2011, they were the number one seeds last year and lost in the quarter-final stage. But well, my goodness, isn't that an impressive list of matches so far? Only seeded opposition was in yesterday's semi-final against the identical twin sisters, Liu Ying and Liu Yu. 22, 20, 21, 7. All of their matches in two straight games and all of their previous matches against Ma Jin and Tang Huanting have been won by the former world champions. But both times that they have met each other, these two pairs, it has gone the full distance. The last time was in the semi-final, as you saw, of the Denmark Super Series event last week. I did say semi-final, didn't I, I hope? Anyway, it was 21-11 in the deciding game. First time they met, of course, was in the All England final. What a thrill that was earlier this year, March earlier uh, this year. 23 21 in the deciding game. Wong Xiao Li and Yu Young won that match. So for the pair in red, well, uh, they may be a lower seed than their opponents, but on paper, they're overwhelming favourites. This is their fifth final from six tournaments this year and their third final from three Super Series tournaments this year. The only two Super Series they played prior to this was the All England Championships, which they won, and last week in Denmark, which they won. Ladies and gentlemen, am I right? Ma Jin, Kang Yu Ting, China. On my left, Yu Yang, Wang Xiaolai, China. <laughs> Ma Jin to serve to Wang Xiaolai, love all, play. One love. So first point of this final to Ma Jin and Tang Juan Ting.
Oh, nicely done. Three lovely. Service over. One, three. Now that's a nice idea from Margin. Good rally. Oh, it's just wide. Lovely idea from Tan Kuanting, the youngest player on court at the age of 20. And I have to say, I thought two, during the four. All England final between these two pairs that it was the youngster who was the best player on court. Decision from Wong Xiao Li. Service over. Five. Have had three. the most remarkable record during their partnership. Yu Young and Wang Xiao Li. Yeah, she was right to take it. It was going to land in, I think. Fault. Four two tournaments. Wang Xiao Li and Yu Young three. have played prior to this, since forming their partnership. Change, please. And they've reached the final of 33 of them. That is just extraordinary. First year of the Premier Super Series events. They won the Grand Slam 2011, won all five Premier events. Now there's the little hand signal, just letting her partner know where she's going to serve to, which shot she's going to cover, as far as the third shot is concerned. Service over. Four, six. Oh, yeah, well, that's the problem with a new partnership as Margin and Tang Fuang Ting. Oh. Five, six. This. Only their seventh ever tournament together. Don't quite yet have the understanding of who's going for the one down the middle and who's going for which shot. But it is Six, a partnership four. that I think has huge potential. Lock there from margin. Defence as well. Oh, 
Well, these long rallies, I suspect, might suit. Now Jin and Tang Yuan Ting a little more. I've talked in the past about whether Yu Yang is at full oh. fitness. And in fact, last week during the final of the Denmark Super Series event, when Wang Xiao Li and Yu Yang had to play against Matsutomo and Takahashi, Morton Frost and myself were talking about the fact that really the tactics against Wang Xiao Li and Yu Yang is to get Yu Yang to the back of the court. She prefers to be at the net, so you get them out of their favoured formation and really isolate and make Yu Yang work from the back of the court. Service over, seven all. No, oh, good serve. Mm, just long, good retrieving though. Um, Eight, seven. That's good judgment. So first time, the former champions have gone into the lead. Service over, eight all. Well, I do apologise about all that noise, if you could hear it too. Yeah, good rally. Service over. Nine, eight. Service oh, service fault, fault call struck above the waist. Service over, nine all. Of the Czech Republic. Hmm, well, that's a little bit naughty from you, Young. Had a little practice serve and looked to the service judges. Put a thumbs up and said, well, would that one have been all right? And you can't really do that. That shouldn't be allowed. Ten, nine. Yes, you Young, yes. Oh, well, she hit the shuffle back. How can she then claim that it wasn't in? Well, no coaching staff involved, of course, because there's two Chinese pairs playing against each other, so the co Chinese coaches. Oh, there's a very famous man on the left, Tai Yun. 
20 seconds. Current Olympic champion in the men's doubles. Eleven ten play. That's gone wide. Over. Yeah, I have to say, watching these two Chinese 11, pairs, all. I think some of the other pairs in well with badminton could learn a thing or two about trying to do something with the defensive play. Their defence is magnificent, but they're not content just to lift it back. Both pairs trying to do something with it, trying to change their defence into attack. 12, 11. Hmm, well, I nearly got that back, you young. Oh, great defence. That's a perfect example of what I was talking about. So too is that. One drove it back, one blocked it. All was vying for the attacking play. Polish pair, uh, Wang Xiaoli and Yu Yang. Look at that ready, coverage please. at the net from Yu Yang. Absolutely superb. Oh, brilliant. She does have so much creativity due to her wonderful racket skills. 14, Look at the 12. disguise on that. Beautiful play. And she's following forward as well. Going wide. Service over. 13, 14. Service over, 15, 13. Hey. That's a good return of serve. Service over, 14, 15. Uh, Super Series tournament final for Ma Jin and Tang Xuan Ting as a pair. Previous two, they lost obviously the All England final against their opponents of today, but also reached the final of the Indonesia Premier Super Series event. Oh, look at that. Goodness me, what good badminton. Time! <laughs> Commitment at the 14. front of the court.
Yeah. Well played by Wang Xiao Li. I'm a big fan of hers, of course, all the attention 14. is on her partner. Her partner having achieved Olympic gold medal status. I mean, I think of the two, I think Wang Xiao Li creates an awful lot of opportunities. 18-14. Well, is this the decisive move? Three straight points and only three points needed for this opening game. Raises the racket in apology. 15 18. Huh? Look at that. Perfection. Most powerful smashes in the game. Wang Xiaoli. 1915. Game point calls the umpire. And in fact, there's five game point opportunities. Oh, my goodness. What a shot from you, young to close out the opening game, 21-15. 19 minutes of play. And this pair are going to have to come back from a game down if they want to win their first ever Super Series title. Look at that from Yu Young. A left her opponents absolutely stranded and when you consider these two pairs must spar against each other on a daily basis normally you know your opponents tricks and where they're likely to play the shuttle that's just an indication of how good that was a very disappointing performance by this pair at the asian games Silver medals four years ago. Lost in the round of last 16 by their own very high standards. That was disappointment. Mm. Are you young saying something about keep those feet moving? Oh mm, dear, wake up. The number seven seeds, Wang Xiao Li and Yu Yang, having taken that very good opening game. 
21-15 against the Second number five game. seeds, Margin and Tan Huang Ting. No, a little delay while well, there's a public announcement about Play. fans not using the flash camera. Good serve. One love. Service over, two, one. Oh, some right idea. Oh. Yeah, absolutely brilliant. Service over. That's the sort of defensive shot. Two, that all. really does put opponents under pressure. Stood at ground on the defence, took the shuttle early, guided it across court. Service over. Three, two. Going wide. Well, Four, two. Developing into quite a battle between Margin and Yu Young at the front of the court. Clever. Nice defence. Well. There was a clash of rackets between Margin and Tang Swanting. Two. Oh, looks at the racket. Yeah. Change quickly. Well, for a moment, See I thought the umpire wasn't going to allow her to change the racket. I thought there was Thank such you. a clash and there was such a noise. I thought perhaps the frame had cracked. Yeah. Good umpiring once she realised what the problem was with the player. There's the confusion again. Dissecting the Six, number two. five seeds. Change, this is the problem with a new partnership. They were both leaving it for Lucky. the other. Who's supposed to take that? Well, I suppose if you look at the general rule, it should have been Tang Yuan Ting. Player slightly on the cross court from where the smash is coming is a usual one to take the shot down the middle. And let's give credit where credit's Due. It was a fine shot from this pair. Service over. Three, six. Luck of the net cord for Margin. 
Yeah, but good, positive Five, play. Six. And the problem is, is that they're being adventurous. They're trying to do the right things, but not often enough are they getting the shuttle on the floor. Flat. Well, I don't think it was Margin's fault. Margin was taking some time, I understand that, but... Fault. Oh, yes. Service over. Seven, five. Service over six seven. A flick serve. Mm. Service over. <laughs> yeah, she's a lovely six. character. Yes, thank you, Auntie. Smiling at her mistake there, saying yeah, it's flying much quicker than I had suspected it would do. Nine. Well, the last final that Margin and Tang Huan Ting were in, they didn't actually contest it. That was the final of the Indonesia Super Series. Gave a walkover to the Olympic champions, Tiang Ching and Zhao Yunlei. the former world champions. Get you young to the back and keep her there. Oh. Service over 10-7. Ladies. Well, oh, very surprised the umpire allowing Flat, them to have please. a uh, tell down. Ah, oh, right. Now I understand why the court needs to be mopped of the perspiration. Well, you know, it's a very interesting dynamic, this final, because Ma Thank Jin you. used to play women's doubles with Wong Xiao Li. In fact, they were world number ones together. One. And in fact, together, they won the title here at the French Open 2009. Now they are on opposite sides of the net. And I can tell you that for the youngster on court, Tang Yuan Ting, the only Super Series title that she's ever won was the India Super Series event earlier this year, Tang Yuan Ting. And she was playing with a certain new young when she won that event. So all four players on court of experienced partnerships with one of their opponents. 
But it does make it an interesting dynamic for this women's doubles final. So a four point advantage for the former champions, Xiao Li and Yu Young. In fact, Wang Xiao Li and Ma Jin has a partnership, not only world number ones, uh, but also medaled in world seconds. championships. 20 seconds. A silver Ladies. and a bronze. Oh, that's interesting. Youngster Tang Yuan Ting is giving some of the instruction. Oh, that's good to see. Normally, when China use one of the much more experienced players, in this case, Ma Jin, playing with one of the youngsters, it's the more experienced player that tends to do all the talking in the advice and encouragement. That's a good sign for Tang Yuan Ting. Good character. It's going on a number of times. She's lifted the shuffle long. Seven. Yeah, well, there's a little tap of encouragement from Margin. That's good to see. Point cushion now for the former world champions, and yet again, look at the despair from Margin. Oh, that's brilliant! Well played from Wang Xiao Li. Right into that back corner there. Lovely play. That's good too. Well, having just played one deep into the backhand corner, very next rally, a switch 15, it and play one seven. very deep into the forehand corner. It's wonderful awareness from Wong Xiao Li and Yu Young. Hey! Yeah, well taken. No, they're both struggling, both Service pairs, over. and trying to lift right to the back of the court. Eight, yeah, the fans here in Stade de Coubertin really trying to lift the younger pair. Good interception from Yu Young. 17 8. Yeah, stamping their authority on the match right 18, now. Eight. They have been the better pair. And it's very, very good to see Wang Xiao Li and Yu Young coming back to something like their previous form. 
when they were on receiver nineteen receiver. Oh dear me. Well, the form that took Wang Xiao Li and Yu Yang to world number one and to two world titles. I know Yu Young has had her injury Stay problems on. earlier this year, but they are looking very, very good once more. Look at that. Yeah. Twenty match point eight. So a whole host of match point opportunities for number seven seeds. Well left Service that short. Over nine twenty. Missed it. 21-15, 21-9. The victory. And a second French Open title for Wang Xiaoli and Yu Young. To add to the one they won in 2011. 37 minutes. And they really went from strength to strength. Their confirmation of the score, 21-15, 21-9. And for Margin and Tang Fuanting in their third Super Series tournament final, it wasn't to be third time lucky. Third time they have to settle for second best. Well, the good news as far as Margin and Tang Yuan Ting is concerned, despite losing today's final, they will go up two places on the Destination Dubai ranking list. They will leapfrog uh, the two Chinese pairs above them. And for Margin and Tang Yuan Ting, they will become uh, the number four pair on those Destination Dubai rankings. So to the prize presentation for the women's doubles. A second French Open title for Wang Xiaoli to add to the one that she won back in 2009 with her opponent of today, Ma Jin.
Yeah, big smiles from Wang Xiao Li. So Margin, who today was contesting her sixth French Open final. For a fourth time, has to settle for second best. And of course, she was mixed doubles champion in 2012. And today she was trying to win a third French Open title with a third women's doubles partner. It wasn't to be. But a first final here while making her first appearance here in Paris for Tang Yuan Ting. Wong Xiao Li and Yu Yang for each of them a third women's doubles title here. A second as a partnership to add to the title they won in 2011. Yu Yang having won the title first here in 2008 with Du Jing. Wang Xiao Li having won the title previously with Ma Jin in 2009. For them, it is a 22nd Super Series title. Their 27th Super Series tournament. Final. What a record that is. Surely, if they can stay injury free, Wang Xiao Li and Yu Yang will go back up. To the top of the world rankings. Paul Eric Koya Larson, President of the Badminton World Federation, IOC member and former Olympic champion himself, along with Richard Arimo, President of the Badminton Voilà, et Paul Eric Hoyer Larson qui invite Snoopy dans cette dans cette photo. Snoopy, la mascotte bien sûr de MetLife, partenaire des BWF World Series. Pour cette très belle photo, alors ça, ça se voit pas sur la photo, mais peut-être quand même avec vos applaudissements, c'est encore mieux. Voilà. Merci à vous toutes et à vous tous. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. For you, Young, staggeringly, this is a 36th Super Series title. Lee Chong Wei has 39. Lee Yong Day, 33. What a remarkable statistic that is.